they hit up against something. The Red Sea, and it's and it like in Egypt. Pharaoh and the people started talking, what were you thinking to let those people just go like that? They were doing the work for us. They were our slaves. So what we're going to do is go back and get them. So what he did is that, Pharaoh, is that he led his army of the best of the best. 600 chariots. Now I want to picture this. Because we see Hollywood, they always show up chariots with one person. But there's always two people in the chariot. One to drive and the other one to be able to fight. Yeah. <laughs> and the chariots is for you to imagine what they are. It's like our honor trucks. That trucks, I mean, trucks that we have in the military. Mm -hmm. You know, that when people start shooting, the bullets just fall out, right? But these chariots were the best of the best. And he said 600 mm. of those chariots in it, and it was being led by Pharaoh himself. Mm -hmm. So can you imagine the people, and he, these people just say, they, they didn't know how to fight. They didn't know how to fight. So what they saw coming at them, was these chariots. And then what's before them is the Red Sea. But we, we look so we try to but I'm gonna tell you something. See, God led them that way for a purpose. All right. Yes. And while they were in that direction, headed that way, God knew that they would be surrounded by all sides and the only thing that was ahead of them was the Red Sea. But see, God had a purpose. Yes, no matter what's yes. after you, the enemy, I don't care how great the enemy may look in the physical, my God is great. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And so when the yes. enemy came yes. after them, they started panicking. And of course, they started drinking on Moses. Oh, yes. But you got to find that for the mm. But then God, and I love verse 13 of Exodus chapter 14, Moses is telling him, he said, okay, y'all, stand still. And see mm -hmm. the salvation of the Lord. Because on this yes. day, God will show himself. And so what did God do? God, God did a miracle above all miracles. He dried up the Red Sea. Yes, he yes. did. He dried it up. And allowed his people, mm -hmm. once somewhere again, his chosen people to walk around, walk on dry ground. Mm -hmm. And then the enemy that's coming after you, mm -hmm. you think it or not. Yes. He confused the enemy. So he led the, his people, but he got behind between the enemy mm -hmm. and his people. See, see, that's yeah. what God is yeah. doing for somebody today. That's right. When you think that you're surrounded by nothing but your enemy, but, but what is what can be my enemy? Well, enemy could be the medical report you got from the doctor. Come on now. Yes. The enemy could be your finances. Come on now. That you go and look and you realize you ain't got. Come on, sister. Right. Your right. enemy could be. On your job, yes. catching hell. Yes. Uh -huh. Your enemy could be right there in the house. So if you feel as though you are surrounded, I tell you, just trust God. Just trust God. Trust. Continue to trust God. Yes. So when the enemy got confused, mm -hmm. and I told you this was the best of the best, mm -hmm. coming after. And that day, as the people of God walked on dry, dry ground, mm -hmm. and the walls of the water is up on each side. Mm -hmm. As they walk across. See, that's what God will do for you. Mm -hmm. He'll allow you to walk across. Oh, come yes. on. As long as you keep your focus on Him. Thank you. Thank you. And so as they walk across, they just keep walking across. And, and we ain't talking about a thousand people. We ain't talking about this time. Because they had been over 430 years since they've been in Egypt. So by this time, where well, it was 72 that came into Egypt, the nation mm -hmm. of Israel, by the time they got as close to 3 billion. Mm -hmm. Yes. As they walk across. Walk across on dry. And then, as the chariots seem like they're getting close, sometimes you feel like they, your enemy is getting close to you, where they could probably reach out. Then they realize something. God slows them up. Now, this is the best of the best. Soldiers. Soldiers. Soldiers mm -hmm. who fought many battles. Come on. Soldiers mm -hmm. who have survived many wars. Soldiers who knew exactly what they were doing and knew how to drive these chariots, all of a sudden the wheels started falling off. Uh -huh. mm. Because they were they were going up against God. Yes. And it was God who was fighting the battle. Mm. 
and yes. not the people not that you should. Yes. And as the wheels started coming up, they said something to themselves. They said, oh, we need to turn around. Because it looked like their God mm -hmm. is fighting for them. All right. Yes. All yes. right. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No matter what it looked like, but just remember, your God, your God. Yes. is fighting your battle already for yes. you. Yes, yes, it will. Yes. And so as they come Thank across, you. The nation of Israel come across. Then God does something a little They see they can't go back now. Uh -uh. They can't go back because they decided to follow the people, but they weren't following the people's God. All right, God. And that's and a difference. That's a difference. Mm -hmm. See, the enemy might try to follow you, but as long as they're not following your God, they All can't right. be saved. All right, now. So as they go on and it gets in the midst, because I think you're going to Moses raises up his arm, his right arm. Once again, power, authority. Amen. The yes. And what happened? Mm. The enemy is no more. That's right. They all drowned in the Red Sea. In the Red Sea. Hallelujah. So yes. what you look at that you had, mm. chasing you, is no more. Because my God is fighting for you. Yes. 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 Thank you, God. Yes. 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 Thank you, God. Thank you. Because I know I haven't seen the song. This battle ain't yours. That's right. It belongs to the Lord. It belongs yes, to the Lord. Yes, yes. So Moses opens up with praise. But on the other side, see, when, when things, when you want to just praise God, mm -hmm. sometimes you praise, you got your music. And they decided right there on the other side to give God praise. Mm -hmm. They decided to lift up the voice. See, the praising of what they were doing was with song. And that's how you sometimes express yourself because that's joy. That's, that's right. Joy. That's right. I want my favorite song. song is my soul is anchored. So when I know yes. Yes. I got through, my soul is anchored. And then I can just imagine that they were singing a song that would be appropriate for this right now. I'll be saying the song, How I Got Over. I got over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My yeah. soul is like a How I Got Over. Hallelujah. And so Moses is, Moses is what they say. He said, I will sing unto the Lord. I read verse 1. I will sing to the Lord when he has trumpet gloriously. The horses in his ride are his throne into the sea. The Lord is my strength and song, mm -hmm. and he has become my salvation. He is my God, and I will praise him. I like to say that because God is my God. I don't yes. know about you, but I know who God Jehovah is. Yes. My Father's God, and I will exalt him. In other words, I'm going to lift him up. Yes. The Lord is a man of war. Yes. See, in this battle that he fought, he was Jehovah's God. Uh -huh. Had his own armies. Yes. Pharaoh had his army, but I'm going to tell you, oh, yeah. there's only one army. Only one army. Mm -hmm. And this army will always win. Always. Cannot be defeated by man. Right. How is it possible that something that's been created by the creator can be create, can be destroyed? That they can think that the creation can destroy the creator. That doesn't make that's any sense. sense. So God had to show him. Come on now. Mm -hmm. As to whom he is. Mm. The Lord is his name. Mm -hmm. Now, Pharaoh's chariots and his army, he has cast into the sea. See, this is the song they sang. He chose his chosen captains also, are all driving in the sea. I told you he sent out the best of the best. Yes, he did. Sent out the best. Amen. And so all of the best mm. are driving in the sea. Mm -hmm. Pharaoh, mm -hmm. his captains, soldiers, all drowned in the sea. Because I told you it's two first chariot. So you got 1,200 of the best of the best, best all drowned in the sea. Sure the death of covered them. They sank to the bottom like stone. Verse 6 says, Your right hand, O Lord, has become glorious in power. Your right hand, O Lord, has dashed the enemy in pieces. And the greatness of your echoes, you have overthrown those who rose against you. You sent forth your wrath. They consumed them like stubble. Mm -hmm. You did that, God. Yes. yes. To the enemy. And with the blast of the nostrils, that means he. Come on. The waters were gathered together. The waters that were side by side and gave dry land for your people, the floods stood up like a heap. That's how they stood up. Mm. The depths concealed in the heart of the sea. The enemy said, oh, okay. Mm. See, when they saw all this, they said, okay, he making it easy. Mm -hmm. But the enemy said, I will pursue, I will overtake, I will divide the spoil. My desire shall be satisfied, and I will draw my sword. My hand shall destroy it. See, that's what the enemy mm -hmm. said. 
Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Come on. See, your enemy is talking right now. All right. Yep. Your enemy is making plans to kill you. Yes. Mm. Your enemy yes. is making yes. plans to destroy you. Mm. But I say right now, in the name of Jesus, it says that God said he blew he, he, your, he, your wind. The sea covered them up. They sank. The sank lay like lead in the mighty sea. While your enemy is trying to intimidate you. While your enemy is plotting and making plans for you, I tell you, God, 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 God is protecting you Hallelujah. from yes. danger seen and danger unseen. Right. That's right. Thank you, God. Thank, Thank you. you. God is yes, yes, he is. So it doesn't matter what your enemy is plotting. Come on. Come on. As long as you belong to him. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. Yes. All right. All right. Because God is able. Yes, he yes, is. He is. So our verse opens up in verse 11. I hope I give you enough right now. I'm yes. saying where we're going here. He says, and then the song says, Who is like you? Mm -hmm. Oh, Lord, among the gods. There are many gods. G O D S. Mm -hmm. Let me make sure y'all understand that. There were many small G O D S mm -hmm. in Egypt. But there was only one G O D S. Yes. yes. The creator. Yes. Right. So they had many different gods mm -hmm. all in Egypt. They had God for the sun, God for the moon, God for fertility, God for water. They had so many different gods. <laughs> mm -hmm. And so in the song, Moses is saying, He said, Who is like you? Mm -hmm. There's nobody but you. Mm -hmm. Who is like you, glorious in holiness? Mm -hmm. God, you're so unique. Your character is such mm -hmm. that nobody can touch it. Come on. Mm -hmm. There's no words to describe how you are. Mm -hmm. And when I get to the point in my life where I just can't see my way, there's nobody but you, God. That's right. Who can even hear my prayer? Who can know my heart? Even when it's so overwhelming, and life will do that to you. Yes. That you just can't even offer up a prayer. Yes, Lord. That's, That's right. when you start growing in the inside. Yes. I'm here to tell you, he understands where you're growing and coming. Yes, he does. Thank right. you, God. Thank even you. when the tears start flowing, mm -hmm. he understands those tears. Yes, he does. Yes. And he understands because he's wiping your tears in the spiritual. Yes. So yes. there's going to come a day when there will never be any more tears. That's yes, right. Lord, I got it. But as we on this side, he's going to shed some tears. Yes, yes. Uh -huh. yes. And it says fearful mm -hmm. and crazy. Mm -hmm. Awesome God. When I try to think of a word and I look through Webster, there ain't, and I'm not saying the word ain't, mm -hmm. there ain't a word That's right. that can adequately really describe God. That's right. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. And the closest I can think of is he's awesome. 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 He's an awesome God. He's mighty. Yes. 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 He's great. Mm -hmm. Yes. 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 And he's worthy. Yes. Of all of our praise. Yes, yes he is. is. Fearful and praises, joy, wonders. Mm -hmm. And by him drowning all of Pharaoh's army, including Pharaoh in the Red Sea, mm. that is still a story. Happened over 2,000, almost 3,000 years ago. It's still a story that the Jews still told. And guess what? Other nations still repeat it. By the time they go into Jericho and declare, get ready to take over, they say, we remember, we heard uh -huh. what had happened with Pharaoh and his army. And still today, and how do we apply this today in our lives when we start looking over our lives? Mm -hmm. Yes, and we yes. start thinking, thinking of everything that has come at us. Oh, yes. We had the enemy chasing us. Yes, we did. Yes. And we wanted to give up and yes. give in. Yes, mm -hmm. yes. We probably cried out. Y'all, we didn't have a Moses, but we cried out to Jesus and said, Lord, God, have you forsaken me? Yes. Oh, we've yes. done that. We've done that. Yes. Yes. Mm. But God. But God. But God. But God. Mm. But God. Is still doing wonders in our lives. Yes, yes, yes. And guess what? Even when we are not deserving. Mm -hmm. That's right. I just thank God for just being his child. Mm -hmm. Yes. Because as my father, mm -hmm. 
He truly cares and loves me. Yes, amen. And my father will always mm -hmm. protect me. Yes, yes, he will. Yes, he will. Yes. Thank God for a father. Yes. Thank you. That's right. So he says, you stretched out your right hand. Mm -hmm. He's going on in the song, Moses is saying, he's saying, uh, you stretched out that right hand. That right hand of power. Mm -hmm. You stretched out, even though it was Moses' hand that stretched out the rod, it was God who moved yes. and simplified his power. Hallelujah. And when you stretch out, I stretch out the right hand to dry up, stretch out the right hand to come, but what you did to the enemy that the earth swallowed them. Mm. And see, that's a sign, symbolic of a sign of judgment. Mm -hmm. I get to, I'm here to tell and help somebody who's here and listening. You ain't got no business trying to get revenge and have the things that belong to God. That's right. Amen. Amen. Tell them again. Yes. This is not your battle. Come on, right? right? It's the Lord's. Yes, yes, it is. Yes. And he and he only is able to judge. Yes. yes. Right. It's not you. Not it's not you. Your, that's not your lane. That's right. That's not so your lane. Come on. Mm. <laughs> What's your saying? Teach us right. to teach. You in your mercy have left for the people. God in his mercy. Thank you, Lord God, for grace and mercy. Thank you, yes, Lord, for grace and mercy. This happened with the nation of Israel, but this right here I'm talking to the people of God right now. Have led forth the people whom, listen to this right here, verse 13. You have redeemed. You in your mercy have led forth the people whom you have redeemed. God has redeemed his people. Mm -hmm. Just like he redeemed the nation of Israel and saved them, he has redeemed his people, those who call him God and those who worship him, those who are saved through Jesus Christ. He's redeemed them. How did he do that, Sister Hall? I'm glad you asked. Through the blood of Jesus. <laughs> you have guided them in your strength. Moses sang the song here. You have guided them in your strength mm -hmm. to your holy habitation. Now, in this case, for the nation of Israel, it was the promised land, <clears throat> Canaan. But for believers and for the Christians today, as God's people, He is leading us out of sin yes. and into eternal life. Yes. Yes, yes, Lord. Yes. So the lesson in the old is so appropriate in the New Testament. Just like he's leading, because he's still leading today. Mm -hmm. He's still leading those out of darkness into the marvelous light. Yes. All yes. they have to do is just receive and accept and believe in Jesus Christ. Yes. Amen. Yes. So he says, God, this is what you do. And it was all because of your grace mm. and your mercy. Yes, Lord. Thank you. And in verse 14, he says, the people would hear it and be afraid. I told you that when they got ready, it took them 40 years to get into the promised land. But by the, by the time they went there, when they sent over the spies and two of the spies started talking, they said, hey, they, 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 said they, they came back and they told it to Joshua. They said, you know what? They heard about us. And they are trembling and they are fearful. See, that's what God will do to the enemy. Yes, he will. Make them afraid. He says, sorrow will take hold of the inhabitants of Philistine. Mm -hmm. Then the chiefs of Edom will be dismayed. The mighty men of Moab trembling and, and will, will take hold of them. The, all the inhabitants of Canaan will melt away. Well, since now you're talking about countries that we don't even know about, they don't even exist today. I'm glad you said that because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put in place what enemy should be fearful of you because of your God. Sickness, mm -hmm. cancer, diabetes. Mm -hmm. Should be a fearful of your God. That's right. Plagues. Oh, we got this pandemic. In other words, instead of us being fearful of it, they, we should let it know who God is. That's right. Yes. COVID 19 should be fearful of God Almighty. Yes, yes. We got people going against one another in all this race. Racists should be fearful of the God of Jehovah. Yes, sir. Yes. Yes, Lord. This unity, this score, hate, yes. should be fearful. Of our, of our God. Yes, and it should be trembling because they are all they are. part of the enemy that's been led by Satan. So I'm saying because notice to Satan today, be fearful. Thank you, Lord. Be 
Thank you. Yes, yes. Trouble. Because God has made a promise to his people. And one thing I know about God, he would never break a promise because God can't lie. That's right. Thank you. Fear and dread will follow them. By the greatness of your arm, they will be as still as stone till your people pass over. Oh Lord, till the people pass over whom you have purchased. He purchased with the blood of Jesus. Mm -hmm. You will bring them in and plant them in the mountain of your inheritance. In the place, O oh Lord, which you have made for your own dwelling. The sanctuary, O oh Lord, which your hands have established. I'm not talking about the sanctuary temple that they had back then. I'm talking about the sanctuary temple in the new heaven and the new earth that's going to come forth. And then we add Miriam to it. And then it says, verse 18, the Lord shall reign forever and ever. And ever. Yes, yes. Forever yes. and ever and for ever. all eternity. Mm -hmm. For the horses of Pharaoh went with, went with his chariots and his horsemen into the sea. And the Lord brought back the waters of the sea upon them. But the truth is Israel went on dry land in the midst of the sea. I'm going to tell you again and remind you, mm -hmm. God's people will always be saved and walk on dry land. Come on. Mm -hmm. Then Miriam the prophetess, the sister of Aaron, and she's also the sister of Moses, mm -hmm. took the temple in her hand. Now I don't have the temple of tambourine. And all the women went out after with timbrels and they would dance. And Miriam answered them singing, sing to the Lord, for he has trumpeted, triumphed gloriously. The horse and his riders he has thrown into the sea. Sing! <laughs> Yes, sir. Into the Lord. I don't have a music yeah, instrument, yeah, but I can. I can yeah. play. I can say hallelujah. Yeah. I can give God praise. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? He is so worthy. Yeah. I can yeah. lift up holy hands and praise Thank him. Thank you. Because, you know, the enemy has been riding me. Yeah. I don't know about you, yes, but I've been dealing with a whole lot. Oh, he's been riding. But I'm telling you right now, the enemy, I put the enemy on notice and said, you need to start trembling. Yes. Because my God, my God is able, yes. and my God will protect yes. me. Mm -hmm. My God has already saved me. My God has already already made it possible. So no matter what comes at me, just remember, just remember what God has already done because it's already all right. Yes. That's yes. the God I serve. So let's praise him. Let's say hallelujah. Throw up hands. Yes. If you yes. got to tell me, start shaking. If you got your bongo, what you got on the sister Ed, what you got sister Shirley, start shaking. That's if you right. ain't got nothing else, lift up your voice yes, and say, hallelujah, Lord God Almighty, because you are able. Yes, Lord. Amen. 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 Thank you, Sister. Amen.